This, is, this for, is a huge issue that you guys are trying to attack, this IT labor problem, I call it, where you know, right. two-thirds of the spend in IT is on people. Right. And we're supposed to be automating right. all these tasks. Right. So it, it, for, with the data growth where it is, that just can't continue, John. Right. Just, yeah, and, and I mean, you, had, you had an initiative a few years back um, called Autonomic Storage. This is different from Autonomic Storage. Yeah, and I, well, I think what we announce around smarter storage is really about several things. It's, it's efficiency mm -hmm. to help with those problems, and efficiency that's built in and, and automatic and, and not needing uh, as many resources to be thinking about it. It's also about self-optimization, so understanding workloads, understanding the performance needs, and again, using the deep analytic skills and math skills we have right. in IBM to deploy that. Right. When I, th know, when all I, of those when I think about some of the growth opportunities in, in big data uh, and, 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 and data analytics, so you have, you're very close to the applications uh, and you're also very close to the business of your customers. Right? So if you're an IBM customer, you're really, really, you know, IBM can be really, really close. How does that sort of drive your ability to differentiate um, in terms of selling the whole solution, selling storage, or designing solutions that are that sure. are better business. Well, I think it allows solvers. us it allows us to differentiate on several levels. First of all, we run some of the largest data centers in the world in IBM on behalf as, of our clients. As an applicant, as a, as an infrastructure outsourcer. As an infrastructure outsourcer. Right. So we and a lot of that's running on IBM gear and. A mix of gear, mix. frankly, because what we acquire through those. Do you pull their stuff gear, in. We pull their stuff yeah. in. So there's a lot of. Uh, experience we're gaining from running some of the largest data centers in the world. So SAN Volume Controller, as an example, would be a wonderful tool for you to drive efficiency into an environment if they hadn't been using right. it and you want to leverage those It's a wonderful assets, right? tool for our strategic outsourcing colleagues to leverage right. to drive efficiency right. for their clients. Right. Okay. At the same time, we also have very tight relationships with our software group colleagues so we work with the streams organization, the analytics teams and software group to how do we refine, based on an experience from our services organization, refine that linkage and integration point we talked about earlier to make sure we're providing the most value to our clients end to end across all of IBM's both software and hardware components. And